We looking good. We looking good. We looking good. We looking good. All right. We looking good. You my business. You my business. Yeah. Don't do that. <laughs> Actually, do that. Do that. Be in my business. Subscribe to my channel and continue watching this haul if you're ready to see some lit pieces. Okay. You can get the biggest Chanel back in the store if you want it. I gave them the drill, they set it up, I got them on it. I bought a new bed, I got had the one, so I took Hello, everybody. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Naomi Amber. And if you're new, what's good? What's popping? It's really lit around here. And if you don't know, now you know. Be sure to subscribe before I even get into the nitty gritty of what's about to be going down today. We are going to be doing a Zara haul. Apparently, the Zara haul that I did before was pretty popular. You guys seem to like it, so I'm back with another one, but this time it's for fall, and I have a lot, like a, I, Jesus Christ, that's how much of it. I got a lot, a lot of stuff. So we're gonna be going through all of that. I've been collecting this over time. Don't think that I just cashed out $1,000 on Zara because sis ain't got money like that, okay? This ain't got money like that. Nonetheless, I have been collecting it over time and I'm gonna show you guys everything that I got, so don't worry, stay tuned, be sure to subscribe. Be sure to follow me on my socials. I finally got it on the right side. Be sure to follow me on my socials and yeah, let's just get into the haul. Like, what are we waiting for? So first things first, we have this dress. Ugh, I love this so much it's this cream den uh, denim it's a denim material but it's a thin denim material so it's not that thick so it gives it a little bit of breathing room and it has these large pockets here come on is it gonna focus it has these cream pockets here and it buttons all the way to the top the dress is pretty short but it's like a comfortable short it's not like a scandalous short so definitely can get away with this for the fall long sleeves and it has like this this is a, a detail. I can't describe the detail. If you see me looking this way, I'm looking at my monitor to make sure we're not out of focus. But back to this. <laughs> so it has this detail here. It's like a puffed sleeve. I don't really know how to describe it, but it's not a regular like straight down jacket. And it does have a little bit of a cinched waist. I don't recall what size I got. I'm going to put my sizes and everything in the description down below. But definitely has like a little cinching going on in the back. I don't know. I don't know how to describe it, but I'm feeling it. I'm feeling the whole dress, and I'm going to show you guys how I styled it on the side. 10 out of 10, on to the next item. So, this next item, I didn't know how I was going to exactly feel about it, and now that I have not I tried to style it, I know that I'm not feeling it, and maybe just this isn't for me. I tried to get... <laughs> I got some brown, they're tan, um, leather pants. Um, maybe it's just because I'm tall, and they just hit my ankle at a really awkward spot. I'm going to insert pictures of like how I tried to style it. So don't laugh or come at me in the comments. But I'm going to show you guys how I tried to style it. And I just, I'm not feeling it. And I got a small. And it's really hard to get on. Like it's really tight. But then around my waist, it's not tight at all. So it's just like, who was doing the measurements when they were making these pants? And I'm scared to get an extra small because I feel like the extra small is going to be too tight. And it already hits my ankle at a weird spot. And I don't want them to be ankle pants. It's just a lot. It's just a lot of cons and not a lot of pros. So I'm going to be selling this on my Poshmark. So if you want to grab it because I already took the tags off. But I never, I only wore it to see if I would like it. But definitely if you want to snag this up, it'll be on my Poshmark because... Honey, I am not feeling it. I tried to, but I ain't feeling so, it. Next, we have this leather jacket. It is to die for. It is on the tighter side, so if you want it to be like an oversized fit, definitely size like two sizes up. Because I got an extra small, and I returned the extra small, got a small, and I still feel like I need a medium. So definitely would size up if you want that oversized look, but it's a very fitting, very good quality. And I'm going to show you guys how it looks on. And it's supposed to come with the belt. But the belt keeps falling out. I don't understand what's going on. Honestly, Zara, get it together. Because the belt won't stay. And even like if I'm walking around a store with this on, the belt will fall out. So I don't know how to make it stay. Maybe I have to sew it onto the belt loops. But I just feel like that's a whole extra step that I shouldn't even have to take. So far, this, this video has been a lot of cons. But I promise you we're getting to the good stuff. We're getting to the good stuff soon. 
but on to the next item the next thing that we have is definitely very fall-esque definitely very fall-esque it is this midi i would say it's midi it's a midi dress it's this stone gray color it's picking up a little purpley brown but it's definitely like a stone gray color like a dolphin gray yeah, it has this turtleneck collar and it's sleeveless and this will definitely pair really nicely with like a trench coat like a black trench coat and some black booties Ooh, like that you see where I'm going with this you see where I'm going but this is definitely a staple very basic so you can pair it with a lot of things get a lot of good use out of this and I'm so excited to wear this for the fall so the next item that I got I definitely feel like this is not the right season for this but I wanted it when I saw it in the store and I thought it would fit me a certain way and I'm gonna show my inspiration for this on the side but I just got this black slip dress this black satin slip dress and it comes down really really long and I'm guessing maybe that's why I don't like it it comes down too long I wanted it to hit like at my like right below my knees and this hits like right above my ankle so if you could imagine like and I'm gonna show you guys how it looks on but it definitely is not flattering to my height <laughs> I don't know and then I thought that the top part would be more of like a cowl neck so it could be a little bit more feminine but it's not it's just again a lot of cons with this <laughs> a lot of cons but it is cute nonetheless I mean I could try and make it work I'm gonna show you guys how I tried and y'all tell me what y'all think maybe I'm bugging maybe I'm bugging the next thing that I got I got this in three different colors so I got it in blue this is a polo this crop polo and it's in this blue color I thought this would look adorable with some black jeans and some black sneakers this is so cute and they fit so nicely like I thought that this would make me look like a blast of the past, like blast of my high school, middle school days. But no, this definitely really, really looks good on me. And I'm actually thoroughly surprised because I thought I was going to look like a little girl. So very hype about that. And then I also got it in brown. As you can see, same spiel, same deal. I feel like brown is really in this fall and winter seasons. I feel like brown is the way to go. These nice chocolate colors, everyone is dying for them. So I definitely, definitely highly recommend copping something like this. If you can, copping this. I hope it's not sold out because that'd be a shame. And then I also got it in black, which I've already wore. Um, this is just so cute. So cute. It's so flattering. I don't think I can express it enough how flattering this is on me. Like, So I definitely highly recommend copying, if you can, any one of these colors in the cropped polo on Zara's website. <laughs> next things next we just got this caramel i'm telling you these tones are really in for the fall they're really really in it's just this caramel ruched short sleeve ribbed dress <laughs> definitely very very flattering like i feel like i wasn't into ruching when it first was a thing but i feel like now that i really have a couple different ruch items in my closet i've definitely gravitated more towards the ruching effect on things this is to die for the color is to die for like i can't wait to you guys see this on my skin like girl 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 it's another chocolate item surprise surprise it's a bodysuit though so it's a brown chocolatey bodysuit and it has shoulder pads on it so it has like a little shoulder padding detail definitely apparently this trend is really european um like having like shoulder pads on your clothing but zara has definitely hopped on the wave and they have a lot of items with a shoulder pad detail and i think this will look so good with some tight some skin tight black pants Ooh. So the next thing that i have is just another top with these shoulder padding details but this one has a mock neck and it's black and it's also not a bodysuit it's cropped and i think this is so grown woman so feminine i just really really adore this and it's also in this it's not rib it's a ribbed material but it's not like one of those noticeable ribs it's like a classy rib i don't know i don't know if i'm describing that right but it's not the regular regular rib okay but it's definitely like i told y'all the shoulder pads are in style i don't know when they got here but it's in style so definitely copy something with some shoulder pads so you don't look like you being left behind okay so the next item that i have is another crop top but it's this it has like this opening right here 
on my I don't even know if you guys can see this it has this opening right here and it's this cream color and it also has like this little turtleneck mock neck detailing as well it's also cropped and oh this is just really to die for this will definitely look good with some black pants as well um and this i just feel like it's gonna look really really nice like on a calm cute winter day like you can wear this under the where's the leather jacket like are you guys seeing the vision here y'all see the vision do y'all <laughs> okay let's, let's have a moment because i'm really excited to show y'all this piece <laughs> This piece is so, so, like, I would have never in a million years thought I would get something like this, but it's this cream puffer jacket. The quality is amazing. Amazing. It's definitely warm because I put it on. Because <laughs> I put it on just to try it on with this outfit that I had in mind, and it's deaf warm because I was sweating in like 2.5 seconds. But it's this cream tan. It's kind of cropped not really because I think I got a size yeah I got a size small so if I got an extra small I'm sure it would be like more cropped but it like hits my waist at the perfect spot like the perfect spot <laughs> this is if you don't get nothing in this haul get this get this get this and I got it to pair with these new shoes that I got which you probably already have seen because I already styled it with this dress <laughs> these are cream tan Air Force ones with this black Nike check it's like a plastic kind of oh these are just like ugh. and then like the gold detailing and the oh everything about this is just where it needs to be uh, lovely love it definitely can't wait to style that jacket with those shoes and <laughs> I'm telling you it's gonna hit harder than cracking the 70s okay next we have a pair of shoes I don't typically gravitate a lot towards Zara's shoes but this I saw in the store and I was like okay I gotta have this because I already know fall is coming I already know the boots need to be in my closet so I just got these cream they're not really tan they're like a, a crew <laughs> they're like in a crew color um definitely not white but definitely not um tan either so it's like a creamy color and it's just a little ankle boot and it fits the ankle really really well and it's so so chic so nice i just can't wait to style these so the uh, last item that we have is kind of similar to the second item i showed it's just these uh, tan suede pants not leather so i bought both of them to see like if i would like either better but i like neither of them <laughs> but it's just these tan suede pants and i don't like it because it's not it's bad quality or anything i don't like it because i just don't like the way it fits me personally i got a small and it also um hits my ankle in a weird place just like the tan suede pants so i guess like their stuff is just really not made for tall girls because obviously 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 i can't wear this but i got in a small so maybe if i got an extra small it would fit my waist a little bit better but this is just like too baggy too too baggy around my waist like it's giving unflattering and i don't like that so definitely not a fave in this haul but i did still want to show you guys what it looks like because maybe it might fit you and your style but yeah that concludes the end of this Zara haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you guys found something that you guys can splurge on, shop on Zara with. Because I know it is kind of hard to shop on their website because they have this whole lookbook thing going for them on the website. And it just makes it terribly hard to shop. But I'm here to help. And I hope I did. And if you like this video, be sure to subscribe. And also, don't forget to follow me on my socials because I do style these items on my Instagram and post them on my Twitter. So definitely go check that out. But I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye. Straight to the pipe, about to blow a couple racks, I said pack out, and I bring the racks in, walking in through the back door, who decides to clap hands? Put it all on the line. Yeah, I'm bad, 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 I'm bad,